Hey! How are you? I can barely reach you. Because <laughs> you're so tall. What's up? Chelsea Spencer's been coming by to collect Teresa Warren for the past seven years. They both live in Queens about a mile apart, but in different neighborhoods. Chelsea has been mentoring Teresa since she was eight years old. Teresa's mom runs a beauty salon and doesn't have a lot of extra time for fun with her oldest daughter. She appreciates Chelsea. I'm so happy. She's so good personal coming together for my daughter because she teach a lot the life. Sometimes a little jealous, but it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Teresa and Chelsea were connected by Kelly Phelan, who runs a mentoring program. I just kind of like knew like she was what Teresa needed. And I called um, Teresa's mom and I was like, send to you to the office right now. And I introduced them and here we are seven years later. Weekdays, Chelsea works at Mount Sinai St. Luke's Hospital where she's a therapist social worker, counseling adults with severe mental illness. A couple of nights a week, she runs a group for kids with ADHD. She started mentoring because she wanted to do more. Um, I wanted to get into social work, so part of me wanted to get involved in kid, working with kids because I loved doing that. I was teaching at the time in um, undergrad and I wanted like a, just a different experience with kids. And also, I wanted to experience fun things in New York City, and I was like, what a great way to do it through mentoring, because then my mentee can come with me and we can go on all these fun trips. The two do go on a lot of adventures together, but also enjoy just going to Chelsea's apartment to hang out. That was so much fun. If they don't have an event planned. We went to go see Alicia Keys um, for Teresa's birthday, and I told her mom, but I didn't tell Teresa. Yeah, it was... Remember, we were getting ready in the salon. My mom's always working. She always has kids around her. And when I go see Chelsea, it's like a whole different world. I'm not with kids 24-7. And um, I get to finally be like a teen, teen girl and have fun. Chelsea's boyfriend, Will, says he was anxious meeting Teresa for the first time. I was more nervous to meet Teresa than I was to meet Chelsea's own parents. Um, and I was right to feel nervous because the first day that we met at Applebee's, uh, I was in the hot seat. Uh, she wanted to know what I did, uh, what my career goals were, how much I made. Um, but I really know she was just trying to find out if I fit into the Chelsea-Teresa dynamic that they've built for, for a few years and we're going to continue to build. Will and Chelsea did get to vacation together on a cruise sponsored by the Farmers of Cabot. Chelsea was nominated for that honor by Kelly Phelan. Chelsea has been consistent. She has been, God, everything Teresa needed. The big sister, um, someone to look up to, someone to turn to, someone who has given her, God, advice, um, helped her in the time of need. And I really just knew if anybody deserved this, it was Chelsea. Um, She's gone above and beyond what a mentor's duties are. It was really nice to meet so many people doing all different types of volunteer work. And it was cool to have people like so interested in what I do. And I got to like talk about Teresa. I showed your pictures to people. <laughs> um, so that was really cool. Um, and the cruise itself was great. The people from Cabot were amazing. Back in <laughs> Queens, Chelsea and Teresa say they have learned a lot about each other's worlds and feel lucky to have one another in their lives. All the stuff that we do, we always have such a good time, so it's been life-changing for me, for sure. <laughs>